Welcome to CMA Fit Factory. We've got a great workout for you today, so clear some space, get rid of that coffee table. If you've got some dumbbells or a light resistance tube, you can use it at the end of class. You ready to get started? Let's go. Start out with our warm up. Roll your head side to side. Feel that good stretch all through your neck and your shoulders. Shoulders and hips, roll two times to the front, two times to the back. Nice big circles, get a good stretch. Just want to get that blood moving, muscles warmed up, joints lubricated, ready to go. Arms, two times to the front, two times to the back.
knee up as you pull your hands down. Tap the floor. Full line of strokes. Front kick will be next. Left leg. Come on, tap the floor. Don't let your heel touch. Don't let your heel touch the floor. Front kick, left leg. You got knee bent. Go on, right to step. Give me 30 seconds. Come on. Kick touch, kick touch. Come on, fast. Out, in, 
down. You're going to point your toes, make your leg long and straight, and hit with your shoelaces. Knee comes up as high as you can before you extend it. up as high as you can and don't lock your leg all the way out and try not to pull your foot all the way back to your bottom. It's kind of halfway both ways. Halfway back, halfway out. If you have to, put it down and then pick it right back up. But try not to rest it for the whole period. Are you feeling good? Yeah. Everybody smile camera. Everybody at home needs to know we're having fun. Slow and controlled. 
Ryan's got dumbbells. So if you got dumbbells at home, do the same thing with the dumbbells. Step it up! Curl, turn, straight up! Now we're going to do a shoulder press. You're pressing straight up with the weight or the tube. You're standing more upright with this one instead of leaning forward. Working the front deltoid. Tiny step through, raise it to the side. With this, if you've got the tube at home, you want to step back through the middle. So now your tube is on the front foot. Working lateral raises, working the shoulders. Bigger step back, elbow stay back, tricep. When you do this, you want to lean forward. Elbows tight, tight to your body. Your elbows don't move and push up. You're pushing upward with your palm. Get your tube on the floor, bicycle! The bicycle, this is the advanced version. Her feet are not touching the floor. The beginner version, your feet touch the floor every time. Roll it over, plank! The plank is a good ab core workout. You want your back flat. Don't sway in. Get on your forearms and hold it nice and tight with your abs. If this is hard to do, separate your feet. Quiet! Bicycle! Sorry. Bicycle again. This is the beginner version. Your feet are touching every other one. This is the advanced version. Make sure you don't wrench your neck. Plank with a knee touch! Plank with the knee touch, all you do is pick your foot up and tap your knee on the floor. Adds a little bit more to those abs, those core muscles. Keeping those abs nice, tight, and contracted. Trying to sway in. Roll it over on your back. Stretch out your arms. Stretch out your legs. Take a deep breath. Hold it and let it out.
is going to benefit if you'll start making everyone eat right. Imagine if you start your kids off young, teach them that they can live on fresh, healthy, wholesome foods. They'll never have to contemplate a diet as an adult or struggle with junk food like some of us do. So give that gift to your kids. Another home safety don't uh, is don't let your cell phones go dead. Keep your cell phones charged up and also keep them in your bedroom at night just in case something bad happens and the phone lines are down or they get cut you have a cell phone that you can use. So keep your cell phone charged and keep it in your bedroom at night. Thanks for joining us at CMA Fit Factory. I'm Carolina. And I'm Chuck. Stay healthy. And keep on kicking. Thanks for watching.